Hey everybody, this is Dr. Dan from eSports Healthcare here to discuss the anatomy of the thoracic outlet. Located in the space between the neck and the shoulder joint, this anatomical passageway is formed from the top of the sternum, the first rib, and the first thoracic vertebra. Above this space lies the clavicle, the scalene muscles of the neck, and the pectoralis minor muscle of the chest. Now, two important structures pass through the thoracic outlet. The first is a bundle of nerves known as the brachial plexus. Now, starting out as nerve roots in the back of the neck, these will pass through the thoracic outlet on their way down the arm to provide both touch sensation and motor control. The other important structure to pass through the thoracic outlet is the subclavian artery. Now this is a blood vessel whose job it is to provide blood down the arm. Impingement of either of these structures can lead to a condition known as thoracic outlet syndrome. If it is the brachial plexus being compressed, then this would be known as a neurogenic form. Whereas if it is the subclavian artery being compressed, then that would be the vascular form. While both may be involved, it is usually the neurogenic form that people would present with. So, to summarize, the thoracic outlet refers to the space between the first rib and the clavicle where both the brachial plexus and the subclavian artery pass through on their way down the arm. Compression of either of these structures at this area can lead to a condition known as thoracic outlet syndrome. For more information on thoracic outlet anatomy or thoracic outlet syndrome, check out our website at esportshealthcare.com. Don't forget to subscribe to us on YouTube and follow us on Twitter at esports underscore health. Thank you for watching and see you next time.